So here we are, Saifi, we haven't met for a while so I thought I'd do a video and introduce a new tune or two. Uh, I'm going to start off with a tune called Galloway Girth and the music is on the website. And the interesting thing about this is it shows how in folk music the actual printed notation is simply a guide. And if you play it the way it's written it's a very, very tedious tune. But because of the way you alter the phrasing it becomes it comes alive. So if you take the the first part of the music, it's played like this. And you can hear the phrasing in there is quite different from how it's written. There's an emphasis on the first note in each of the groups, and then the second two are run together. Now that music could have been written out in the way a classical musician would do with all of the expression in there. But folk musicians never bother with that. They just plunk it down as a reminder. OK, so let's try the tune out. Oh, one, two, three, four. to you in a minute because this is a great tune for chord players just want to deal with the melody to start with now the B music second part of the music again the phrasing's got a similar uh, edge to it so try that one two three four and I'll put in a bass end on the melodeon uh, and then we'll look at the guitar part. Here we go. One, two, three, four. <laughs> changes here and of course we've got the E minor in there where you can give lovely power chord in there and hold that chord and let it ring on in the B music. Okay so this time try and give it some uh, emphasis again pick up that first uh, beat in the bar um, with, your, with your chords when you're playing. Okay and we we'll try it a little bit faster. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Thank you. 
course you'll notice that folk musicians do naturally with the tune. They don't play it the same way all the time. They change it, they'll change melody, they'll add infills, and also they'll uh, uh, change the rhythm slightly at times too. Uh, and maybe put in shock chords uh, themselves, where I went... <laughs> Okay, it just it just livens the tune up, so don't be afraid to have a go at that. Okay, right. Uh, the chords are on the music as well, so have a go with those chords and see what fun you can have it. I'll play it through again the way I would normally play. One, two, three, four. <laughs> you might play the tune eight or nine times through and you get fairly bored playing the same tune exactly the same all the time so you vary it and you play around with it and some of the things you do work and some of them don't work but so long as you can keep going it doesn't really matter anyway have fun with that one <laughs> 